Hi you guys and welcome back to my channel. Today's video is a before work clean with me. I am cooking breakfast for the boys and doing some cleaning before I have to go into work. If you are new here, my name is Rogina. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Thank you so much for clicking on this video. I hope you like it and me enough to hit that subscribe button down below. Also, don't forget to hit that notification bell so you're notified every time I upload a video. So this is one of those days where I didn't have to be at work until 12 o'clock so I decided to go ahead and get up and start breakfast for Christian and Caleb. I was pretty much cooking and cleaning at the same time so while the oven was getting hot I was loading the dishwasher. While the waffles were cooking I was kind of picking up and straightening up and putting stuff backward where it belonged. Of course my husband cooked eggs the day before and he burned them all in the bottom of that pan so I decided to put some water in it and put it back on the stove to let it get hot and loosen up the eggs on the bottom so I could scrape it clean. to do 
So while Caleb was eating breakfast, they gave me time to kind of sweep and finish cleaning the kitchen. He was out of the way so I could get some things done. Christian decided he wanted Funfetti pancakes, so now I am about to make his pancakes so he can eat and I can finish cleaning. I got this really cute griddle from Aldi and I don't know why I didn't buy one earlier. It makes cooking so much easier, especially breakfast. You can cook at least like six pancakes on a thing. I can cook my sausage and eggs simultaneously. Like it's so, so great and it is so easy to clean. While the griddle is getting hot, I'm gonna go ahead and scrape all of those eggs out of that skillet. You really don't have to use oil on this griddle because it is non-stick, but child, we are down south and we love crispy edges on our pancakes. Now that both of them have eaten, I'm going to tackle the rest of this, I was about to say laundry, the rest of the dishes. <laughs> This mesh strainer is another Aldi buy, y'all. I buy so much random stuff at Aldi. Once I go down that like seasonal aisle, honey, Aldi gets all of my money. 
y'all already know I put as much as I possibly can in our dishwasher because I do not want to hand wash all of that stuff and I just hand wash my pots and pans and no I do not pre-rinse my dishes because I use the cascade platinum tabs and those are literally literally the best tabs to use I love them I don't have to rinse anything I don't have to run my dishwasher twice they work really really well shoe cabinet from Ikea I absolutely love it but we are gonna have to get another one because it just does not hold enough shoes it was perfect when it was just uh, four of us but now yeah, there are five of us and we definitely need another one so I think I'm gonna go once Ikea opens back up and get um, another one to put on the side of the door so I have one on either side of the door and it won't be in this spot anymore um I don't know why they don't put their shoes in here and it's so annoying and I'm constantly saying either put your shoes in the shoe cabinet or I'm throwing them in the garbage but they still don't put them in there. Once I actually start throwing them away, I think they will get the message. No, I don't wanna step into the light. If I don't get you shoddy, you bring out the sweetness of my life. Oh yeah. Come on in, give me that, give me that, give me that. This Dyson came with two floor attachments. One is for carpet and the other is for hard floors. Them 
Caleb has been really into video games lately, so he was trying to get me to um, put the video game on so he could play it. It's like some little motorcycle game that he likes, and I was just trying to help him get it together. So I'm just realizing that this is the last video I recorded with Caleb and his hair. He just got his first haircut um, yesterday, actually and he looks like a little big boy now i was like so sad but it was time he turned two so it was time to let it go back to the kitchen both of them are done eating breakfast so i can finally clean this nasty table y'all this table was so gross oh my gosh it needs to be cleaned so bad and caleb had waste syrup all over it and everywhere and here he comes again making another mess I know, I know I need to clean these chairs so bad, but my plan is to get some get them shampooed and then retreat them with Scotch Guard.
I really wasn't planning on cleaning this much stuff before I had to go to work, but y'all already know how it goes sometimes. You start cleaning one thing and it just snowballs until your whole house is clean. And this is how it looks after everything is now clean and neat and in place. And now it's time for me to go to my actual job. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you in the next one. Can we just open up? Cause I got to know if you feel the things I